Hi guys, Flying Fish here, and welcome back to, uh, the circus, I guess you would... I'm sorry, I, I mean, uh, World Tournament. Yeah, very fun, fun times. Um, yeah, we are, um, right now we are currently closing in very soon to the global 7th anniversary, and usually before these anniversaries, like right before, they like to throw a world tournament our way. So this just came out this morning and uh, yeah, we're just gonna, I'm, I'm gonna be stuck here for three days doing this, how fun. So this is the 41st world tournament. Very, very exciting world tournament. Everyone loves world tournament, such a fun mode. Uh, I'm joking, this is the worst. Uh, we got our new reward card this season is Goten. Our Team Goten from the end of Z, which is actually uh, pretty cool because this is the last sort of uh, World Tournament reward card that JP got. Like right now, I think they've got like Team Trunks from the end of Z, and then before that they had Goten. So Global is kind of catching up in, in terms of like World Tournaments with JP. So hopefully that means like coming up soon, we might see like... I don't know, like a new world tournament card early on Global that happened in the past with like uh, the physical Mighty Mask, I believe, and the physical Bojack. They were first on Global um, and like not on JP, but uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> and uh, local rewards are the Mercenary Tau as they have been for like the last uh, few tournaments. You know, the weird thing about the local rewards is that they've all got this like little arrow thing right here. You can click it, it doesn't do anything. I don't know. I don't know why. It's not on the other ones. That's weird. Um, we got all the missions here for lots and lots of stones. Uh, I do think these are actually worth doing if you are a global player. Uh, if you don't want to sit here and grind the world tournament for three days like uh, most of us, <laughs> I, I would at least recommend you like do these. Like I think in order to clear all these missions, you have to play the world. You have to win the world tournament. Uh, 30 times, I believe. Uh, how many? I'm, like, at 38 wins. So, like, yeah, roughly that. So, if you just, if you, you have to beat the World Tournament about, um, 10 times a day. Which is, like, not even, like, I, I mean, I say that, I get, like, around, like, 50 to 60 wins in, like, a day. The day's not even over yet, and I'm already at 38. But, yeah. Um, oh, yeah. And also, in terms of the Goten unit, uh, he's not very good at all, but... He is a new named character, Goten Teen, so, you know, you might as- I mean, you might as well get the mission and, like, just get him, like, at least one of him, I think. So, uh, yeah, that's the- that's the World Tournament. We're gonna be jumping in. Uh, I'll let you see my team right here. So, I've actually- I am running a different team than I normally would run for the World Tournament. Uh, this time- oh, hang on, let me just sort this by pure Saiyans and target Goku. There we go. Uh, this is the team I'm running for the World Tournament this season. Uh, I actually took off Jocko in replacement for Majin Vegeta because I, I'm, I'm just sticking to using items instead of relying on them. Because the thing with the World Tournament is the higher uh, team cost your team has, the more, uh, like, the higher team cost of, like, the enemies you fight. And usually the high, the, the amount of points you get at the end of, like, a fight or a battle is de dependent on what the team cost of their team was. So in order to get the most out of a world tournament, you want to run like as many LRs as possible. And I've also got the Chaozu on here because he's stunning all enemies. And I would have, I would have replaced him with the um, Vegeta and Nappa LR, but I actually don't have them. <laughs> I, uh, yeah, uh, I actually really, really want Vegeta and Nappa, which is like hilarious because I'm like one of the fe only few players on the planet who wants that unit because <laughs> uh, they suck. They actually do suck normally. Yeah, and uh, these are the items I'm bringing. Ghost Usher, uh, Baba. I'm using King Yama and also the Chi Lai item, which is mostly for Vegeta. However, if we get like a bad turn or something where we don't have enough orbs for Broly, uh, you can just use that to uh, get them all. So yeah, maybe I should have explained all this as I was uh, <laughs> actually running through this, but, oh well, whatever. It's just, I, <laughs> I, I, I want to put off <laughs> any world tournament of time as much as possible, because you see, some people out there genuinely believe that the world tournament is, like, the, is the world tournament is, 
like not as bad as chain battle or like chain battle is worse in the world tournament and i'm sorry to say this but you are actually just crazy if you believe that that is just no oh yeah and i can show you my team cost right here um 443 team cost yeah that would be higher if i had the vegeta and napa but i don't really feel like replacing chaozu so yeah we get chaozu around occasionally and then it's like we spare an item but um, wow, gosh, I am the worst. I forgot what I was talking about. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, but the World Tournament sucks, and so is the preliminaries, because we have to watch this stupid animation, because we got all one, so we can't get over there. Yeah, they're just gonna keep running at each other. Yeah, yeah thanks for taking all those points, CPU. Yeah, and they're gonna do it again, yep. <sighs> the World Tournament... As sucky as it is, would be so much better if they just removed the stupid preliminary phase. Look, they're gonna do it again. Look, they're gonna do it again. Let me let me see it. Let me see. Oh no, yeah, the six. Okay, thankfully. Woo! Alright, okay, we can actually get up here and get them. Um oh, this is annoying. We don't have a uh so Broly doesn't have a pure hybrid Saiyans enemies, because you know they got killed, so Broly's not getting his extra key. That's fine. Uh, we can just put curl in the front right here and you'll take this. Um, generally, I don't... I tend not to use items in the preliminaries because uh, the enemies here don't hit as hard as they do in the later fights. Uh, and not to mention that um, the enemies... It's actually... They... The, okay. Believe me when I say this. The preliminary enemies do not super attack you. I don't know why I just did that. I could have attacked with Broly, but oh well. Uh, yeah, preliminary enemies do not super attack. Which is why I am not afraid of, like, putting enemies in the front right here. Or, like, not using an item when Broly... LR Broly's attacking in the front right there. Because I know he's not going to super. Watch, he's not. Yeah, see. The enemies don't super attack in the preliminaries. I've been playing the World Tournament. Like, I get, like... A, <laughs> I get routinely over a hundred runs done, a hundred wins every world tournament, which is like a hundred over a hundred runs in the preliminaries. I've never been super attacked once in the preliminaries. They you can't they they can't super attack you in the preliminary. So I I literally just don't worry about that. But it's like like I know I can take the hit in the front. It's it's fine. Like I don't care. Like right here. Um. Well, actually, this isn't a bad example, but say there's, like, an AGL enemy, I'd be, like, and, like, the Goku wasn't around, I'd be, like, oh, yeah, we're fine here. Well, we also have Chiaotzu. This is a really bad example to showcase what I'm talking about, but, um, yeah. Uh, I don't know if anyone ever has been, anyone can prove that they can super in the preliminaries. I genuinely do not believe so, and I, that's why I very uh, casually just throw units in the first slot to take a hit or two because um yeah yeah i'm not, just not worried about it but i do have to sort of hold back on that now because i'm using the ginyu as the leader the ginyu force as a leader uh their leader skill is all types key three all stats 120 percent which is good for running like like so we can have all these aoe units here but it is not good in re regards to like stats and stuff because before, if you remember my old team, I used to run uh, the physical Dragon Ball Super Broly as the leader, the movie boss slash full power leader. And I'd run like STR LR Broly. Um, why did I do that? That was an accident. Um, you know, STR Fat Boo and the uh, physical Krillin as like my AoEs. And then I ran like Chaozu and Jocko. And Broly as a leader, I do believe he's giving... Um, I believe it is, he. I know he gives more attack to our our units. I don't remember if it was more HP or defense that he gives from leader skill, but just do know we should have like ideally we would have more HP and defense if we had Broly as our leader. So with this Ginyu as our leader, we are uh, missing a bit of HP and defense. So yeah, I cannot <laughs> I cannot rely on taking the first hit many of the times. I believe one time I was hit for like 220,000 damage on a normal attack and I'm just like, oh! oh. <laughs> and you know, when you only have 280k health, that's like, oh, um, yeah, how about that? <laughs> um, yeah, uh, I don't know. Anyway, uh, yeah, we're, I'm just gonna do a few world tournament runs right here. 
Uh, and then we've got a whole load of world tournament tickets and we are going to be doing some summons in there. And I actually do have, um, there's a new unit in the world tournament banner that I actually need. And I will be talking about that. Okay, see, here we go. Um, I'm going to pop a... Well, Maj Vegeta kind of scares me. Uh, you know, let's just use the Ghost Tusher. <laughs> I have a, I have a s suspicious feeling that... Um, Vegeta might survive the two supers from Broly if he- well, they had a- oh my gosh, are we- They would survive because if- like if Broly didn't crit or anything, but it probably would have been fine, but I'm just gonna play it on the safe side, because if Broly, even if he got normal attack, it's, that that's just death, but he does- I do realize he has the Ginyu as his leader as well, which means the enemies we're facing here do have less HP, so we- uh, we probably would have been fine. But you know what they say, being too safe never hurts. So, yeah. What can you do? What can you do? Uh, this So this season of World Tournament, I am... Well, for all World Tournaments, realistically nowadays, I try to get... Just, just get within the top 2,000 in the world. Solely so I can um, rainbow the new World Tournament unit. That being this Goten right here. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's like the bare minimum of what I want. But for this world tournament, I, I feel like I want to play just a little more. I feel like I want to get a little bit higher than 2,000. So I can get more, um, world tournament guaranteed SSR tickets. Because I'm gonna, I'm gonna need those, I think. Because if I get unlucky, I will, um, I will most definitely need some more of those. Uh, also, uh, let's not forget... AGL Beerus, uh, that, that boy, uh, let's pop a Baba right here, because we're gonna hit in the first, see, I, I'm fine with getting, I'm, I'm fine with taking that hit right there, we're not gonna die, I just need to know that it's not a super attack, and that's, that, that's all the comfort I need, so watch, watch, see, we're fine, we're fine, yep, yep, okay, goodbye, goodbye, idiots, <laughs> Physical Cell, uh, by the way, is really, really good here after his easy A, I believe he gets attack 30%, per enemy on the field and like that it, it has no cap so no <laughs> uh so how many fight enemies was that like seven enemies right that's the world tournament because it's like the six on the team and then like the friend unit so yeah yeah there's six and seven sorry seven enemies so he's getting like attack plus 210 percent on that on that turn or just in any of the turns that he's here so yeah, that physical cell is a very, very good option here. If you guys ha have him, I would absolutely recommend you run him. Um, also, the Ginyu as the leader. Um, he's also supporting allies by giving them three key. And I think he does give... Is it? It's either attack or defense from his passive. Um, at one, he's fully easy aid. Uh, mine, unfortunately, is not fully easy aid. He only has the first step done because... I do not have enough uh, battlefield gems to actually buy all the medals. I recently used my battlefield gems to uh, rainbow the Int Krillin in AGL Android 18, and like also like buy all the copies of like the LRs that are in there. So uh, yeah, I currently do not have them EZA, but if you're able to at least get like the first stage of their EZA, which is I believe 10 medals, I think then you can get their access to their leader skill, which you can use for the world tournament. So yeah, the, the physical Ginyu Force is really, really well here, and they allow you to bring um, Cell and uh, the AGL Majin Vegeta, who, strangely enough, is not on the full power category, which is very strange because he's literally doing an attack that, would ta that takes all of the power in his body and sacrifices himself. So I, I do not understand why he's not on full power, but you know what they say, people be crazy. Uh, also, keep, do keep in mind Broly um, is attacks effective against all- LR Broly, I mean, is attack effective against all types when there is a Goku's family enemy. So there- you saw there was like God Goku, um, Kaioken Goku, and Bardock here. So even if just one of those, we have type advantage against all enemies. So yeah, this is just nothing to worry about here. Nope, 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 nope. So I wasn't worried about the AGL. Um, whoever was there, I don't even remember it now. My- the trick to surviving in the world tournament is like, you gotta- you gotta find a way to distract yourself somehow. Like, like you you can't just focus all your attention into here. You're you're gonna go insane if you try to do that. Uh, yeah. So usually when I play the world tournament, I've got like 
like the YouTube mini player up and I'm like watching like the truth videos or something or uh, I don't know any long uh, videos I can find that are like that can keep me entertained. Uh, earlier I had both YouTube and Twitter <laughs> open. <laughs> So, you just have to find something to distract your mind with, or else, you know, you're just gonna, you're gonna lose it from how absolutely boring this World Tournament is. Also, you cannot use the auto mode in World Tournament. I don't believe I've mentioned that yet. I haven't done a World Tournament video since the, um, the World Tournament with Tech Gohan, which I believe was two World Tournaments ago, and the auto mode wasn't out. But yeah, there's no, you cannot auto in the World Tournament, which is like so dumb to me like not that i'd recommend people use it because the auto um doesn't like you know it doesn't use items it doesn't check rotations it doesn't like s strategize or anything so like if you you jump in with the auto you're ju you're just gonna get like <laughs> you're just gonna get eviscerated basically immediately but i feel like they should at least have like auto like on the map so i don't have to freaking freaking like choose each path every two seconds and get with the get up to the enemy and i would use the auto battle function actually when i like i do this a lot like if i've got like a situation like this right here i would do let's first pretend we had broly and i didn't have to do all this like item shenanigans right here to so say i had this turn I would grab all of this with Vegeta, and then I just turn on auto battle because, like, it doesn't even it doesn't even matter what orbs our other guys collect here because I know uh, Vegeta is just about to one shot them all, and I don't even have to worry about it. But yeah, I it's it's dumb. It is very dumb. I think auto should be here. The fact that it's not is very very stupid. The world tournament just overall just needs a revamp so bad. This is this is mind numbing, and I I I hate it. I hate it so much, but, like, <laughs> you just, I still recommend everyone just get the rewards from this, like, the mission rewards. Uh, you do get lots of Elder Kai's, you get Dragon Ball Summon Saga, Dragon Ball Saga Summon tickets, which are, like, the units there are, like, not even that good, but they're, like, kind of exclusive, so. I mean, a few of them are good, I believe. Like, the physical, uh, Max Power Roshi, who I actually do not have. Uh, he is very, very good, as he's the only, like, official Kamehameha support unit up to this day, still. And he came out, like, like forever ago, so... I mean, there, not that there aren't, like, filler options you can use for supports, like the, the physical Gohan, the one who easy A's, the, um, like, the hero villain extermination event one, that guy, He's giving like all types, what's it like key three or two, and then like attack and defense 35%. He's honestly much better than Roshi, I'm betting, but like, he, he, like it's still like Ma Master Roshi is the only like official Kamehameha leader, so yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I still want him because just collection's sake. Uh, anyway, we're gonna finish up this round right here, and oh, look, it's the same exact enemy. Or what are the odds on? We're gonna finish this up, and then uh, we're gonna jump into some World Tournament uh, ticket summons. Uh, thankfully, I was not impulsive, and I saved all my tickets from all the missions. So that's very, very good. So we're gonna have a lot of opportunities to get what we are looking for. And of course, this is a perfect situation. Okay, there we go. Uh, the Goku and Frieza might survive, uh, but I hope they don't. <laughs> I really hope they don't. And thank you, Chiaotzu, for making me... Letting me have to spare an item, that's very, very nice. So hopefully we crit, crit, crit. That wasn't a crit, but I think they're dead anyway. Uh, am I right? Yeah, okay. There we go. Uh, yeah, fun, fun world tournament. Uh, I'm going to be doing this for uh, the whole rest of the day. And the day, and tomorrow, and the day after. Well, I work tomorrow, so I won't be doing it as much. But, uh, you know, this, this is the worst. I hate world tournament. I hate it so much. Uh, let's jump into some uh, World Tournament Summon, shall we? So this is one of the huge main reasons I actually play a World Tournament. It is for these tickets to do summons. So we've got this World Tournament uh, banner right here and the uh, the Dragon Ball Saga uh, banner. And uh, Anine awakens now. She's the new like awakening unit from this. 
So, in terms of the units that I need, uh, let me just go check really quick. Uh, most of them are unfeatured, I do believe. Um, such as, um, AGL Bardock, I need one more dupe of him, I already have two in the box. Uh, so I need- so one more Bardock, I need three more of this Gohan, and five AGL Beeruses, because I have actually never pulled AGL Beerus in, like, these last seven years of World Tournaments, which is very, very fun and hilarious. I sure would love to pull AGL beer sometime. And, oh yeah, the new unit I was talking about is this Trunks, in fact. So, this Trunks was from a World Tournament, I believe right before the Tech Gohan one, and I actually did not get this guy fully done because, uh, these, these schmucks, these Bandai Namco, Akatsuki, whoever, decided to drop a World Tournament literally on New Year's Eve and I for a part of just how horrible that is like oh thanks for opening a new year with a freaking world tournament I was um also not in the best headspace at the time so I was just like no I'm just I'm just so not up to this so I got like I don't remember what place I got and I think it was like maybe in the top 10k because I got one copy of him and then the other copy from the mission so I still need three more of this guy, and he- this is the first time he's featured on the World Tournament banner. So, this is one of the few only times where I could actually use the feature unit- <laughs> a featured unit on here. So, getting a featured unit animation is not like instant loss anymore, so that's good. Um, and then also the- the Dragon Ball Saga, uh, summon banner. Uh, I need a Neen. I haven't pulled a single copy of a Neen. I need four more Piccolo. I need four more TNs. I need uh, three, three, two more of these Gokus. I don't remember. Uh, and then I need some like unfeatured units on here too. Um, where is it? Uh, so I have you rainbowed. You're rainbowed. You're rainbowed. I need three more of Kami or two more. I don't. I think it's three. Uh, you're rainbowed. You're rainbowed. I need two more Jackie Chuns. You're rainbowed. You're rainbowed. You're rainbowed. You're rainbowed. And I have not pulled max power Jackie Chun. So. Yeah, a good, a good number of units that I need from here. Um, Alright, uh, let's just start. I'm going to start on the Dragon Ball uh, Saga summons. And hopefully we can get some good SSRs here that I can actually use. Uh, oh, look, there's Vegeta. Unfortunately, there's no Dokkan, Dokkan Fests or LRs on this banner. So that is literally just means nothing, which is awesome. I, you know, I, uh, there's one point where I genuinely believe that they would add a sort of like a Dokkan, like a Dragon Ball Saga, uh, like LR to this banner in the future, and, you know, they still might, like, I don't know, like, they could, like, they could surprise us, but, you know, it's, I don't know, I don't know, so if they did that, then it's, like, actually, like, Vegeta showing up could actually mean something, but for the moment, it's just, you treat, I treat him no differently from, like, Fat Boo showing up. Because if you know Fat Poo showing up, Fat Poo has no combination with any character. So it's like if you see Fat Poo, it's just like, oh, this is nothing. Except for like Fat uh, Hercule Riding Boo, but like that's like that that's completely different. That's not even the same like sprite. Uh, we just pulled the same R unit back to back. That's wonderful. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, I would really like. Oh, okay. uh, I would really like to pull. Uh, at least one thing we can use here, pretty please. I, oh, for, uh, well, I don't think, I didn't have him SA-10, so I can use that, I guess. Uh, but that's not what I meant. I mean, SSRs. Uh, if you guys remember, back in the day, this Dragon Ball Saga banner used to be, like, 2% SSR rates, which is really, really bad. But around that time, like, SSRs were like such a rarity like they they literally were super super rares so like if you pulled an SSR it's like yes I pulled an SSR let's go but nowadays it's like you know you get a guaranteed SSR like routinely every multi and it's they're just not SSRs just aren't as rare as they used to be now so I don't know I don't, I don't know where I'm going with this it's just a little uh, fun fact for you right there, um, yeah, I don't know. 
Uh, please give me something good. Please give me something I can use. Oh, yeah, I should also, um, oh, yeah, there's Vegeta again. Yeah, Vegeta. Whoa, Vegeta, is this gonna be a fusion? Oh, no. Oh, I hesitated for a second there. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I, I am, I am slightly losing my mind. You again? Are you serious? Well, I, I, I didn't, I don't have him SA-10 yet, so, I mean, can use it, I mean, I guess. Uh, trunks, wonderful. Uh, let's jump into, um, let's jump into a couple of the guaranteed SSR ones after this, shall we? Because I'm, I'm getting, I'm getting sick of seeing this g garbage pop up on my screen. <laughs> uh, okay, um, let's do a few of the guaranteed SSR ones. So, you already know who I'm looking for here. Uh, if we get a featured an an animation, it's actually not, uh, lost this time. I hope it's in trunks, but I need three of him. So, let's see. Okay, okay, this is good. This could be AGL Beerus, or AGL Bardock, or AGL Gohan. You know, it's funny that, like, all the units I need, except for, like, Trunks, are AGL. Um, I'll also take, uh, copies of the LRs, too, because I want to rainbow their LR, TUR, SSR. Uh, Frieza, I did not need that. I have him rainbowed, so, yeah, that is kind of worthless, but... Oh, well, uh, uh, let's just do... Let's, let's just pop another one, shall we? Uh, I'll do one more after this, too. Um, okay, that's four characters. That's not- oh, wait, that was 17 and 18. Okay, so that- that- this is a featured unit or an LR, so... Please give me something I can use. Please give me trunks. I need trunks. Please, 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 please give me trunks. I need trunks. I need trunks more than any of the LRs, so please... <sighs> yes. I've- I've pulled this stupid hit so many times. Is he even featured? He's gotta be featured. That's what we got the animation for, right? Okay, he is featured, all right. All right, fun. Fun stuff. Well, let's pop one of the gold ones. Um, they're not any different than the silver tickets, but I, I don't know. Uh, Piccolo and 17, that is not an animation, actually. I feel like it kind of should be, though. But, okay. Uh, AGL Beerus, please, I need, could you, if you could at least give me one copy of AGL Beerus, that's literally all I could, what is that? Oh my gosh. <sighs> Why? All of this, all this world tournament grinding, and this is how you repay me. Garbage. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Oh, let's just finish up these world tournament uh, tickets, and then we'll do the rest of the SSRs. Uh, nothing. Again, cool. Yeah. I wonder if we're gonna get anything here. Oh, I wonder if you can be an SSR. One in ten chance to get an SSR. I wonder. Oh, bandages. Oh. Uh, I don't know if I have an SA-10. I'm trying to max out, like, all these, like, exclusive sort of units. Uh, yeah, this is... What a great video this has been. <laughs> Yeah, thank you for playing, spending the last three days doing the world tournament. Here's some garbage for you. Thank you. I, we hope you continue to enjoy, enjoy Dragon Ball Z Dokkan. <laughs> oh, nothing again. Oh, I'm getting, I'm getting too annoyed too quick. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm really sorry, but, uh, it's just, <laughs> you guys, you guys don't, you guys have to understand how awful the world tournament is. Like, this is just the... It's just pain. It's just pain. It's like that, uh, the guy from Naruto. I haven't actually watched Naruto. Uh, that's on my, um, watch list for some time in the future. I don't know. Um, uh, still nothing. You think Goku and Gohan alone would be an animation, but it's not for some reason. Unless they want to give me an SSR anyway right here. Uh, or it's gonna be an SR Yamcha. Uh, Bulma. Okay. Uh, I can't actually use that for the essay of, like, one unit, so... <laughs> uh, I'm just coping. This is just a video of cope. Well, I, if you guys are playing the World Tournament, I really hope your summons do go a lot better than mine. Uh, this is just... Can, can we can we just get, like, one SSR from these tickets, please? Just please, like, something... Uh, that's still nothing. That's not, not an animation. Any day, any day you want to drop an SSR in my box, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. This Yamcha. Alright. Last four tickets. You know, 
according to the rate of averages and whatever, we should have gotten at least one SSR from these tickets. But, uh, this is going to be the Ox King? Is this the Ox King or Invisible Man? Uh, no, it's General Blue. Wow. Very, very... You know, that, guy, that General Blue actually used to be really good back in the day. Back when the Super Strike events needed you to have under 100 team costs to take them on. Yeah, those were the days, man. Oh, uh, anyway, here's bandages. Oh, no, it's King Choppa. I... I who the, who the thunk it? It's him. It's him again. Once again, for the third time in these um, summons. Um, you've seen that combo at least once already. <sighs> Oma again. This is... We, we literally just got nothing. This is literally just nothing. No SSRs. That's wonderful. That's actually wonderful. Yeah. Yeah, thank you so much for playing Delcom Battle. Yeah, here's here's your SR King Choppa. So wonderful. I hate this stupid Dragon Ball summon so much. Whoa, yes, yeah, so good. I love this banner. Okay, let's just let's just wrap this up. Let's just get the rest of our garbage right here. Yeah, gimme give gimme give SR18. Give me more SR hits, please. Yeah. Yeah, no animation. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, give me garbage. I like garbage. Give me all the garbage. Yes. Yes. Give me garbage. Give me garbage. Let me see. Let me see the garbage. Yeah. Yeah. Mighty mask. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I need. I need it. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. What is that? What is that? Oh, I didn't have his SSR. I've got the SSR now. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. He's featured too. He is featured. Yeah. Give me that garbage. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Unfeatured animation. Don't worry. This is going to be... Um, um, who's the worst unfeatured unit I could pull? Uh, I don't know, maybe like, uh, I, I don't know, the tech Super Saiyan Goku, maybe. Um, oh, Pan! Woo! She just awakened. Awesome. Very, very cool. What is that? Um, Alright, so now I've got three extras. Awesome! Woo! Last one! Last one! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Can they give me the Tech Super Saiyan Goku? If this is Tech Super Saiyan Goku, I'm just ending the video, by the way. No, it's just... 18... Well, did we... Hang on, did we... Hang on, I just... I, 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 I need to see this. Okay, so... We had Trunks, 18, 17... Mighty Map. We pulled every featured unit except for Trunks... And 17. And like. It's. Of, of, dude, literally, of course. I. We hope you continue to enjoy playing Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. <sighs> what a what a joke. What a joke how they put this in the freaking world tournament news. Ah Well, there goes um, any chance I had at a good day. So um let me know in the comments how you guys did. So thank you all so much for watching this video. Please hit that like button and subscribe if you feel like it. I love you all and I will um see you guys next time. Bye-bye!